It was already established a month ago that the PlayStation Classic actually uses a free and open source emulator to run games from the golden period. Now those who have used emulators before will know that they come with emulator settings, which basically allow you to mess around with a game in several ways such as changing frame rates, skipping levels and missions, and activating cheats. These same emulator settings are obviously present on the PlayStation Classic because it uses an existing emulation software without any robust customization. The only difference is that Sony has hidden them away. It turns out there is actually a very easy method to access them on the retro console. Hi, I'm Wes Malik from Pixel Enemy and here is what you need to know. According to a new video posted by YouTube channel Retro Gaming Arts earlier this week, the PlayStation Classic can detect USB peripherals. Simply find a USB keyboard and connect it through the available port. Now start any game and press Escape to access the emulator itself. There's a bit of trick and fair warning here that needs to be promptly noted. It appears that the PlayStation Classic is not able to detect every USB keyboard. Those from Logitech and Corsair are said to be the only ones working right now. Secondly, there seems to be a risk of bricking the console while trying to access the emulator settings. Some games can break completely as soon as the emulator settings come up, which either crashes or freezes the console. Were you able to access the emulator settings through the same method? Did you brick your PlayStation? Let us know in the comments below. The PlayStation Classic is now available from participating retailers for $100.